Hi everybody. First of all, apologies for not having posted for a while. I, I've been preoccupied with what's going on and one thing or another, as I'm sure you all have. But I want to thank, to, thank you for your emails. And what I'd like to say too is, if you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe to my channel. It doesn't cost anything, there's no commitment, but at least it lets me know that someone out there is listening to what I'm doing and I'm not waffling on and talking to myself, which would be sad, wouldn't it? Anyway, um, I've had lots of emails from, from you asking about various things and I'm going to do some videos on them, but today I'm just going to do a short thing and, and talk about where we are at the moment. Um, a lot of people have said, why, why did 10 years have to break up? And it, it's, it's one of those questions, it's the elephant in the room really, isn't it? And um, I don't want to say, I don't really want to talk about things. Imagine you're, you're married to three people at the same time. It was very tough being in a band and um, people's, people's aspirations and hopes and, and where they want to go with their life changes. And, and that's really what happened with 10 years after. If you think um, about what Alvin Lee and myself, he was 15, I was 16 when we started playing. By the time we reached 25 and then been living in each other's pockets for that long, uh, uh, where we want to be in our life changes. And um, everyone has a right to, to, you know, to make their own decisions. So I can understand that. In retrospect, I can understand it. I guess at the time when, I, first of all, Alvin wanted to end the band, I wasn't happy because I was enjoying it. Um, but some people thought it was Woodstock that killed it. And I know that people have said, oh, Woodstock turned us into a travelling jukebox. But to be perfectly honest, that some of that's true. But the real thing is, is where do you want to go? Here are the opportunities. The world's at your feet. Around 1969, 1970, 71, the world was at 10 years after the feet. And we could have done anything we wanted to. We could have um, improved the show with, with lighting. We could have done a whole acoustic tour. We could do anything we wanted to do. Better records, work with different producers, work with different musicians, work with an orchestra, and become a circus act. Anything you want to do. So it really, it really was a, a question of been at it too long, been living in the pockets of the same people for too long, need to take a little bit of a break. And that's what we did. And periodically, of course, we reformed. But it always comes down to the same thing, what people want to do. Different people have different ideas. And if you can't agree on it, it's best to go your own way. And um, latterly, that's what I did 10 years ago when I finally quit the 10 years after thing and started my own band, 170 Split, which... Um, if some of you probably aren't aware of, maybe you, on, on my YouTube channel there are, there are a few um, videos which you may want to check out. Anyway, this is a short video at the moment. I want to be positive about the Covid thing getting over. I want all my musician friends to be out there touring again, as I do myself. Music's so important, isn't it, to, to um, our well-being. Music and arts and uh, those people that, that um, run the governments please get it together. I hope you get realised how important it is to people's psychological well-being that, to have some music and some arts. Anyway, take care. I shall post soon uh, with some stories of, of the 60s and 70s, and, um, which you've all been asking for. And uh, good luck with your music, whether you're listening or whether you're a musician. Have a great week. Bye.